garden is a restoration of a garden that was originally built in 1689 by William and Mary. Uh, and when they made Hampton Court Palace their principal residence, they wanted to have a kitchen garden nearby so they could supply themselves with fruit and vegetables. It's been really interesting doing all the research to find out what was commonly grown and eaten. Uh, there's a surprising amount of salad vegetables. Uh, they, they loved their uh, radicchios and rockets and basils. So yeah, quite a diverse uh, diet. We started this project in the late, late summer 2013, hard to believe, but uh, eventually finishing it in the summer of 2014. There was one really big objective which I think we all had, which was to reconnect uh, the gardens here with a piece of its lost gardening history. And the kitchen garden just did that perfectly. We had to remove what was in this garden already and to level the site completely. Uh, and then we began groundwork, so then we did some archaeology to find what was going on under there. And then finally, uh, in early spring 2014, we began to plant the garden. It's a very seasonal garden. Uh, the kitchen garden is always producing different crops at different times. So we're here in June at the moment and we're in the middle of the early peas and broad beans and early cabbages. But things will change really quickly as you go through the seasons and you'll start seeing the summer crops like the tomatoes and the peppers. And then through the autumn you get the squashes and into the winter with lots of, lots of kales and other brassicas. We are very much a productive garden, so um, at the moment we're gearing up to start our market store. So we'll, we sell the produce once a week uh, at a public market store, which is proving very popular.